Hello, this is day four of Heather Broadband's um, Fantastic Fundamentals and it's about setting up the left hand uh, from the fourth, starting with the fourth finger so that um, the um, fingers have a better chance of staying like helicopters above the spots and they don't fly away and the hand doesn't fold out. Okay. So I find it uh, necessary for myself to think about my left hand position as I said in the first video I think um, and uh, I've kind of uh, reorganized my left hand a bit and um, so what I want to do and I don't quite remember if there was a specific task to do. <laughs> so what I thought of doing was um, to play these uh, uh, scales across um, the strings and one key. So I'm doing G major because I'm practicing the G major uh, Mozart violin concerto and also the G major Dvorak 8th symphony. Um, and uh, I'm not going one, two, three, four with each finger, but uh, uh, four, two, three, one in this, um, in this um, order. So, and also, I thought it would be good to have a drone <laughs> sound. So I'm playing that ba basically with the first finger in the fifth. my thumb was a little bit too far back and also there was tension in the thumb so I'm doing this once more. actually um, a good exercise because the hand has to stay in a good position <laughs> so it um, very, feels very good. So let's do that in third position. third finger if it goes down that the fourth doesn't have to do some kind of contortion
So I think that's a very useful um, exercise for me. And rather than doing these normal scales, I do these across the string, two octave scales in, in this form. Okay, good. Thank you for the suggestion, Heather. And um, thank you all for watching this. Anybody still here with me? <laughs> Bye for now.